This program contains strong language throughout. Did you go to after school? Yeah, yeah. Did you? Yeah. Did acting classes on that. I'm so happy that me and Emma are finally getting our groove on. Just me and her, no exes. I was in Hollyoaks for a couple of years. Did I miss Lever get me out of here? Did you? Yeah, yeah. Did you see spiders? <sighs> yeah, I seen spiders. Were you scared of the spiders? Not really. Were you screaming? If the creepy crawlies didn't frighten you, Malik, what's on its way will definitely have you running scared. I remember the first like little trial that we did. And, uh, and we had to hold on to the button while spiders were dropping on our heads in it, and you had to keep holding on to the button. And if you let go. Oh shit, then. Oh shit, then. Hi, guys. Oh. <gasps> oh. This is my worst nightmare. I'm Jaquine, by the way. You alright? <laughs> yeah, you. Somebody call the sheriff. There's a new ex in town. I'm Jakeem, I'm 21 years old and I'm a full-time model. I met Malik on a dating show, we went on a few dates together. After the second date, we spent the night together and he went back and told the dating experts and I felt like that was quite personal to me and I didn't really like that. I felt like it was really disrespectful and rude. My family and friends were all watching this and I don't think any girl should have to put up with that. Today I'm here to tell my side of the story, have my say on it, and to kind of let him know how I felt on that day, and that it wasn't okay to say them things. Last time we kind of spoke, it was really quite rude and disrespectful. Okay. We met on like a dating show, but I never got to say kind of what I felt about it. We basically had a two days. On the second day, we went back and we spent the night together, uh, which is like fine, but then he went back and told everyone that we sat together, which I don't know why he said that, because it was in our personal time, and then he just goes blurts it out to, on national yeah. TV. Yeah, no, I For know everyone to see, like my whole family see it, everything. He was saying stuff like, um, oh yeah, we had sex all night. Oh, Jakeem is not holding back. She's giving away every single little detail. I just want to escape. And stuff like that, which is a bit... First of all, we didn't have sex all night. Like, that was a bit over-exaggerating. We didn't really have sex all night. It just made it sound worse than it actually was. I'd like to give Malik the benefit of the doubt, but I'm not sure how I feel about it at the minute. I think at the time, obviously, I do regret doing that. I think I was definitely way out of order. And um, there's, like, there's no excuse to what I did in it. And obviously, I'm sorry for what I did in that, in it. There's no excuse in it. His apology is a bit weak, but I'll take it for now.